Action News Jax is hearing for the first time from the woman seen in this video handcuffed, beaten by a Jacksonville Sheriff's officer. We caught up with Myra Martinez as she left her court hearing just a few hours ago downtown. Action News Jax, Romney Smith is in the newsroom right now. Romney, she says she just wants to put all of this behind her. She does, Don. Myra Martinez says she's just getting back into her normal routine, and that's all she wants right now. In April, Myra Martinez was arrested for trespassing at Scores Bar on University Boulevard and using violence towards an officer. This video shows the first encounter she had with rookie JSO officer Akinyeme Borisade. After she was handcuffed and brought to the Duval County Jail, a second video shows Martinez trying to kick Officer Borisade. Then she's punched several times by the rookie officer. You could see her slumped to the ground, unconscious. Officer Borisade was arrested and fired. Now Martinez tells Action News Jax she's trying to get back into her regular routine. It's been very refreshing to get back, you know, into the studio and on the mat again. And um, my injuries are healing well, so I can get back into my normal routines again. So it's good. Martinez's lawyer says today's court appearance was quick and simple. Yeah, it was just the arraignment, so entering a plea of not guilty. We just got discovery, so we'll review everything and uh, get in touch with the state attorney's office and move forward. Former Officer Borisade has not been formally charged. However, Martinez is still hoping to get justice soon. Um, relieved. Everything's going, you know, as planned and smoothly. So, you know, as long as I don't have any surprises, I'm good. I just want to move on and move forward from the situation. JSO Under Sheriff Pat Ivey says Borisade will have a chance to clear his name at a name clearing hearing. We'll continue to follow this case and let you know what happens. Reporting live in the newsroom, Romney Smith, CBS 47, Action News Jax.